If you're building anything real time, then you must know these four concepts and I'm pretty sure you haven't heard about the third one. Number one, short polling. In short polling, your front end keeps sending the request to back and every few seconds expecting new data. But if the server doesn't have new data, it keeps sending back the old data. It's very easy to implement, but very inefficient. Number two, long polling. In long polling, your front end makes a request to the back end server, but back end server doesn't respond back immediately. Instead, it waits until it has something new to return. The connection stays open for longer, which makes it much more efficient than short polling. Number three, server sent events, which is also my favorite and not many people know about it. Instead of your front end asking the server repeatedly, the server pushes new data automatically. It's a unidirectional stream where only the server can send messages. It's great for notifications, stock prices, dashboards, anything that updates frequently. Number four, WebSockets. WebSockets is a popular choice for real-time applications. It creates a persistent bi-directional channel between the server and the client, where both the parties can send messages anytime. It's perfect for chat applications, multiplayer games, or live collaboration systems. It's also the most complex one to implement, so only use it if you truly need it. If you found this useful, follow for more, and I'll see you in the next one.